Booker Corrigan here for CUDA.com and the Under Armour Underclassmen Elite All-Stars for the Gonzaga big win over Calvert Hall. Alex Corboy, Timmy Monahan, two guys who really came and brought Gonzaga back. Alex, tell us a little bit about how you guys felt leading at halftime today. Uh, we felt good. We, we had great defense. Uh, we had to keep pushing the offensive end. We kind of we kind of slowed down a little bit there in the third quarter, but we picked it up in the fourth. So we were really excited going into halftime with our lead. And Timmy Monahan, you logged on to www.istingcorners.com a couple times. Tell us a little bit about those shots. Um, well, I rely on my lefty shot and I practice it a lot. So um, when I get open, I'll I'll shoot it if I have it and pretty much. Yeah, one of the things I heard was bringing it, slinging it, stinging it. Is that a true statement? <laughs> yeah, it is. <laughs> right, no, no crime in that, right? No. All right, now let's talk a little bit about your goaltender. Timmy Farrell Timmy. played great today. Timmy played great today. Big saves all day long. Uh, we really rely on him, especially late in the games, to pick us up when the offense is slacking a little bit, and he played really great. And Tim, let's talk about how you felt when Fitzpatrick threw that last goal in to give you the two goal advantage. Really had to feel good. I felt good. Um, he's definitely one of our best midfielders. We rely, we rely on him a lot, and we knew he was going to get it done in the final seconds. And then face-off wise, you come in and Stephen Kelly, obviously one of the best face-off guys in the country, but your guy held his own. Goulian did a great job. Yeah, Tyler played great today. He's been playing great all season. We're really excited to see him go against a uh, big-time uh, face-off guy who's going to North Carolina and beat up on him pretty good. All right, now let's get into some of the important parts. You guys start spring break today. You got two weeks off. What do you got on the schedule? Uh, well, we got Wooten tomorrow, and then got a lot of practice, and then uh, not really doing anything, just hanging out, resting up. Prestige Worldwide? <laughs> what? I know what Prestige is. Prestige Worldwide? Oh, yeah. Wide, wide, wide? Yeah. Yeah, I'll be there. All right. Yeah, boats and Hose? Oh, Boats and Hose is what uh, I yeah. I live for Boats and Hose. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. <laughs> now, let's talk. You've seen some games on CUDA before? Oh, yeah. What's your favorite aspect of watching a game on CUDA? Uh, the announcer, Booker Corgan. Oh, come on. You're just saying that because I'm right next to you. You're bigger than I am. I don't know what you're talking about. You're a great announcer. All right. Well, I appreciate that. Was he being serious? Is he kind of, you know, yeah. what do we got here? I think he's serious. What? Great, really? great yeah. announcer. Yeah. Best comments. You got a gun in your waist. Please don't shoot at the place. That's him. <laughs> yeah. Guy was slinging it today. Slinging it. Is that always with him? Yeah, of course. What about Tuesday against BL? You guys didn't pick a lot of corners. No, we didn't. They're we good, though. They're good. They're very good. Number one in the country. That was a yeah. tough one. That's all right, though. You know, you guys got a little revenge today against the MIA. Revenge. Great game. Again, Alex Corboy, Timmy Monahan, Under Armour, underclassmen, elite players of the game. They both played better than I did today.